This one good. For real, for real. It's your girl, Miss A Couple Styles, and welcome or welcome back to my channel, A Couple Styles, because one just isn't enough. Here we'll talk about fashion, lifestyle, travel, and a couple styles. So if that's what you're into and you want to be all about the styles, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe so you can join the styles team and become a style. Hey, y'all. Happy Monday. It's been a minute since you've seen your girl in the morning vlog, but I'm back with it. This time took a little time. I was doing some unboxings, so, but I'm back. You already know, kids off to school, still on my not big breakfast routine. So, I'm about to have some oatmeal. I'm not crazy about oatmeal, but it is what it is, and I'm gonna have it. Oh, and I got my nails done yesterday. Still with the red. I don't know, I'm on vacation next month, so maybe I'll switch it up then. I don't know, I'm just, I got the red before Christmas and I just been hooked. Listen, y'all should have said that. And maybe that's why they used to say don't get red nails. In addition to whatever else they used to say, maybe that's the reason why, because once you get them, it's just, once you pop, the fun don't stop. But yeah, I'm about to make my oatmeal. I'm just debating if I'm gonna unwrap my hair. I'm thinking about washing my hair, straightening it. Um, I wasn't going to because I'm like, I don't know. I'm about to get my hair done soon again. But then I'm like, no, I'm going to I was going to get my hair done. Then I'm like, I don't know. So now I'm going back and forth with that. Because I know I'm going to get my hair done in four weeks for the trip. So I'm just trying to debate what I want to do. I was going to just wash it and just let it, and wash it, blow dry, and then just do like a bun for the next few weeks. But then all that tension. So I'm like, I don't think I want to do that either. So. Here I am, here I am. I got a bunch of dollars I can spend them on her. So yeah, I don't know. Then I gotta do another unboxing this week. I'm about to drop the video with the girls where they was trying these snacks they had got when we went to Philly. So that's probably gonna drop today. So you watching this on Sunday. That means that video already dropped. If you ain't see it, go back and watch it. So the mini stylists, they had to get their little shine. Um, then that's it. That's all I'm gonna do for right now. So let me get to this oatmeal. It's early. Got the kids to school. One time, one time. Earlier than one time. So I got time for me. Boom. I told y'all before I got these glass bowls. And they be fly. And they annoying. They cute. But they annoying. So yeah, but let me get to it. Oh, and I'm gonna cook dinner today. Me and Ari made um, seafood yesterday. And then um, Ju had burgers. So I believe she has leftovers from that. And then we have some leftover seafood. So we'll have that tonight. So that's easy. Cause like I said, I got a couple things to do. I got some unboxings to do. So yeah. So I'm about to sit down, watch Tommy. Y'all really waiting in 2024 for Euphoria? I mean, do we have a choice? Maybe if we just spam the page, we can get them to give it to us sooner. On the we can get them to give it to us sooner. I don't know, but 
in the interim. Oh, you know what? I gotta watch one. Oh, I had started it the other day and I had fell asleep. You know how we do? We turn the show on, fall asleep to it. So I fell asleep the long one. That's what I'm about to get to. I'm about to watch Law and Order and then get to work. And then I'm gonna do it y'all later. Maybe at lunch. I don't know. Talk soon, stylers. Hey y'all, good evening. It feels so weird that it's still light outside and it is 5.42. Listen, I be mad at the hour that I lost of sleep, but then I be happy that it don't be dark at 4.30 because when it get dark at 4.30, it it'd be like, what's left to do, go to bed, get off work and go to bed, cook dinner, go to bed. Um, we just don't be in the mood to do anything when it's dark outside. So I'm about to make me, uh, I told you I had the rest of the boil, but I'm gonna make some noodles to go with it. So I'm about to do that now. And then that's gonna be it. Oh, yeah, I got my hair done. Cause sweat. The lady did it quick too. 30 minutes. Boom, come here for a little out. Boop, got that blow dry, got that heat to my scalp. And then I was good. So now, like I said, I'm about to cook. After I cook, um, that's it. Well, that's not it, but I'm gonna eat. <laughs> me and the girls gonna eat. So me and um, Ari got the boy. I told you about her um, stuff. So I'm good then. And then I gotta. Make a video. Video for me at 6. So again, by the time y'all watch this, it's already going to be out. So if you ain't see it after this, go watch that. And then, um, next week. Oh, you might even see the video that I'm about to do. Because that might drop on Wednesday because it's an unboxing. I don't know. But if it is, I'm going to link it in the cards. Alright. I'm going to burn myself. So scratch that. Jude don't got no leftovers. She making herself garlic bread grilled cheeses for dinner. What she wanted? I mean, when we want what we want, we want what we want, and we want to eat what we want. So, listen, I ain't mad at it. You like it, I love it. I ain't got to do it, I love it more. <laughs> you feel me? Oopsie. Noodles chicken out of the pot. Let me get back to it. Okay, so we're going to use the Sakya Mama season with the shrimp and it's it sounds good finally found it finally found it so i bought two i ain't go od i just bought two but yeah i was souped up about it because everybody always talking about put the slap your mama on there put the slap your mama on there so i had to get me some because it's something so good to make you want to slap your mama it's either that spicy or it just tastes that good. Because, I mean, I can't really think of nothing that make me want to slap my mama. Because I love that lady. You feel me? That's my best friend. My. Mommy, mommy. <laughs> I can't do the other one. This is good. Okay, so it's me and Ari. And we're on our way to school. Bright and early. Top of the top. <laughs> yes. Um, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're out and about early this morning because the girls got to get to school, get in line, do what they got to do. And then I have a morning meeting with my aunt. She has a business. She's a tutor. So I'm going to meet up with her. We're going to talk about some business stuff. Um, over a little break fast and um i think that's it so yeah we're out top of the top getting the girls off to school and you probably see me back after the breakfast is done if you could barely see me now but yeah you'll probably see me um after that meeting and then i'll go from there all right mm -hmm. tell the girls to have a good day at school <laughs> bye all right bye <laughs> before school minutes before she has to go in school so as you saw she is resting so now i'm just letting allow her to get her rest while i look at my hair so i know i talked about it before when i first got my hair cut that it was a lot of product in it so it was weighted down so i don't know i could feel the difference now and this time i was like hope oh, no product and look i feel like it's more fluffy it got a little bounce to it everybody know <laughs> got more bounce than an ounce yeah shades a couple styles of course 
it's sunny out here today but hold on so yeah can you see it it's cute cute yeah so i'm liking that i got this extra bounce it's not weighted down because i told you i got naturally oily hair so putting anything in addition to what it's already going to do on its own is just too much so i'm here for it hey y'all so your girl is back in the house had breakfast with my aunt you know this place i went to <clears throat> i'm either going to insert it or you probably saw it before or maybe after um we went to i got french toast scrambled eggs with cheese and turkey bacon but the french toast had strawberries and bananas on it it was so fresh listen it was probably fresh and fresh it was so delectable i have some left over i'll probably eat it for lunch um if it sustains because it was so much um i was full and i had orange juice to drink and my aunt had got a turkey hash with caramelized onion with um eggs that was good too so definitely a start to a good day well a good way to start the day productive conversation um that was really good and then um now i'm about to get to work i'm thinking about eating a big meal like that it's like i want to lay down like well i feel like i should be resting now like i don't even know what's gonna be for dinner i think today is tuesday so i was gonna go the easy route and be like taco tuesday yep i'm probably gonna take some ground turkey out right now take the ground turkey out i have um the pasta that i made i have left over so i'm not gonna eat that now for lunch that's that's too heavy so i still have that but i can have it for lunch tomorrow if i decide to make the tacos tonight so i'll probably do that and then to tell you the truth if we do taco tuesday ari be making the meat and she do the tacos so as long as i take it out she'll be down to whip it up chef them pots up so i might even do that because she love nachos so if i'm like oh ari i took the ground turkey out I don't even like, like you want to make it. She's like, I'll make it. I'll make it. So, fingers crossed she's still in that mood. Because depending, she's, um, she had practice start back today. So, she might have, she might be tired. But we're going to see. But, and my camera rocked it off. So, I'll be back. Y'all, coach got to stop playing with me. Look at this big old box my stuff came in. Like, okay, I just had ordered something from them maybe a few months back. And they stuffed it in wrapper. Hold on, let me turn this on the camera now. I had just bought something from them and they had stuffed it in a wrapper like a little envelope you know the little padded envelope and they stuffed it in to capacity but this they put it in this big coach why y'all playing with me you know what i'm not even going to complain you know why because i got my stuff <laughs> and that's all that matters at the end of the day so unboxing coming soon well, hopefully y'all can see me or y'all could see me so i just got a package i had ordered something from tori Bird. And I usually put um, gift wrap on it, even if it's not a gift. I mean, it's a gift. I'm gifting myself. But, you know, it's not a truly, technically a gift to somebody. So I forgot to do that on this. But I'm like, oh, it should be good. No problem. First of all, I was souped up because I ordered it on Sunday. And it was like, it'll be here Tuesday. So I'm like, what? So, yeah, you know, it came. So, you know, I'm going to do an unboxing. But I'm like, let me, something just told me, like, open it up and just make sure anything what it's supposed to be so i open it up ain't no duster so i'm like i'm gonna call because you know i've got stuff from them like, you know i got the shoes whatever and they came with the duster so i'm like ain't no duster what's this about so it's not really a big thing but kind of a big thing so i called them um they was really helpful they was like oh we could send you one but it could take up to 14 to 18 days for you to get it because we got to send it snail mail or you can pick one up, or no they didn't even suggest that i pick it up i said can i pick it up from the store then they said okay we got to call and make sure they have one for you we don't want to have you driving you know somewhere and they don't even have what you're looking for okay cool no problem so they're like okay we're gonna call you back let you know they called me and told me they have it so what is your girl doing your girl is going to pick up her dust i know you're probably like what but listen for the price of these tory birch is luxury so for this luxury price i should have a duster and that's right i'm going to pick it up gas 29 dollars a gallon 
and that's the only part that's really impeding me but then also you know you better get a discount on the next thing so i'm trying to look at the glass as half full opposed to half empty I'm trying to put my duster and get back in the house all right but yeah i just had to come on that's my little rant about my whole situation so yeah that's what i'm doing that's where i'm going and then i'm back in the house all right y'all so i got my duster pretty seamless painless process the most pain was spinning the gas to get here but other than that everything else was good they already had my name they knew i was coming so they had it ready for me so i just had to pick it up get enticed about something else but i didn't and girl held it down and now that's it out of here. It's all right, y'all. And I look hecka shiny. Probably because I was fake cooking. I wasn't really cooking because Ari was cooking. I'm just here. Nachos made by Ari. Happy Wednesday, y'all. Mm, don't mind that. I'm gonna do it in a minute. Happy Wednesday. Half of the week is gone. Me almost to the weekend. I'm starting to really think that it should be something done. They want to change their life savings time, all these other things. Why we ain't changed the work week yet? At least give us like three days for the weekend. I'm saying, listen, I'm not complaining, but I'm saying it makes sense, right? And then, can y'all believe it? I went to the grocery store this morning. I ain't pick up nothing extra though. Went to the grocery store this morning. You know, I went food shopping on Sunday, but then I was like, you know what? I think I want to make Italian sausages. So I'm like, we could put them on bread, regular, you know, sliced bread, but it ain't going to get that same box. So I went and got hot dog buns. They ain't had no real rolls, so I had to get what I had to. And I got this salad. For me, as a side, the girls probably going to have fries. That's their thing. We all love fries, so they probably had that. And then I got the cheat code. The peppers already sliced up in the onion. Listen, you gotta work smarter, not harder. And then, the intimate danishes was on sale. And me and A Boogie Luddy. So I got these. I'm actually gonna have a half of one this morning with a fried egg. And the best bread, I got that. So yeah, that's what I'm about to do this morning. I'm about to get to it, get to my breakfast so I can get to my work day because they're engaging me today. I got unseen calls. I got calls on top of calls. You know, racks on top of racks. I don't have that. I got calls on top of calls. So I got to do that. So I got to do that. And then that's it. So yeah, I'm about to eat me half of a Danish. Put this stuff in the refrigerator. Fry my eggs. Oh, I should have some tea. I ain't had tea all week. I'm going to make me some tea. And then that's going to be it for you. I'm going to need some tea, get my water. And I think I'm going to listen to a Nipsey interview this morning. So insightful. So yeah, I probably listen to a Nipsey interview, do this stuff, and then when it's time to start work, I'm going to get to work. Uh, if you can't see my whole face, my bad. But y'all, my tea selection today is wet. I ran out of my raspberry Zynga tea, and that's my favorite one. And I have this chamomile, vanilla, and honey, and then I have just a regular lemon tea. I think I bought these when my mom was here visiting, and then for her, because she likes tea as well, um, and depending on <laughs> how this tastes, they still might be here when she visits again, because um, I'm going to make some. Uh, I might have got the lemon one when my mom was here. And I think I got this chamomile, vanilla, and honey when I said I might go to drinking tea at night because isn't chamomile supposed to relax you? So, ugh, we gonna see what it's giving. I got lemon tea. I'm gonna put lemon on top of it. I don't know how I missed that, but listen, I ain't going back to the grocery store. Mm -mm. I got a week before it's time for me to go back. So I'm gonna just have to thug it out. Look. Yeah, I just came back to say that. 
my tea selection is whack. Good afternoon. Or oh, good evening. I told y'all I was gonna wrap my unwrap my hair earlier. <laughs> I didn't. Anyway, I ain't have to be on camera for none of those videos. I'm just doing a not even a real unboxing. I'm just seeing. I ordered this from Amazon for my trip. A little cosmetic pouch. It's pink. It's cute. It's sectioned off. So yeah, ain't nothing really to see here. Just seeing what it is, I had ordered some other stuff. Um, but yeah, another time, another place. I'm about to cook dinner. Is it my hands okay? If they did, I just washed them. But yeah, um, what am I about to do? Oh yeah, I'm about to cook dinner. Uh, it was no band this week, so we get home like a couple minutes earlier. So we trying to use all that time, you know, time sprung forward. And before you know it, it be nine o'clock. So I be like, yeah, I'm gonna get back on. But then it'd be late, so I'd be like, I ain't getting back on. So yeah, I'm about to make my Italian sausages. I told y'all I was making that. You saw the cheat code earlier with the peppers. A little wet. My Italian sausages. Make those. Style it up how you want to. I told y'all I'm gonna have salad, maybe like one or two fries. And then the girls will probably have fries. Not probably, they will have fries. So that's it, work was busy. I was on calls from 10 a.m. I was supposed to go in, but because I had so many calls, it was like, it didn't make sense. So I had calls from 10 a.m. until 4 p.m. And the 4 p.m. call went over three minutes. Yes, I counted the three minutes because I had things to do. Then, of course, I had endless emails. You know, some calls you, you know, you're just sitting and listening to, so you don't really got to do much. All these calls I had to present on. So I was talking, talking, and talking. So, yeah, but that's what I'm about to do, cook dinner. It was a busy day. But tomorrow, Thursday, halfway through the week, deciding if I'm going to do laundry tomorrow. Most likely I will. I don't have no plans for the weekend, but, you know, these kids, they be thinking of stuff. But that's it. I'm going, I don't think, I'm, fingers crossed, I don't have to go back to the grocery store. I went today, and you know what I forgot to get that I really wanted to get? Oatmeal. That's why you're supposed to write a list, because I forgot the oatmeal. But now I'm like... I'm gonna just have to tough it out. I had cereal. You saw me had a Danish early. I do something like that, like a half a Danish, or I do a piece of toast with like a boiled egg or egg fry hard. Cause I'm trying to stay up out the grocery store. I'm trying to stay up out of store in general. <laughs> I made myself laugh. But yeah, that's it. I got my reading done while I was waiting for a boogie at Chili in practice. Me and Drew, we got our reading done for today. She's doing a little extra, she's trying she try to show me up. <laughs> but yeah, let me get to it, cause I'm rambling now. In return, I'm scrambling now. <laughs> let me get to whipping up these pots now. So yeah, that's what I'ma do. How y'all Wednesday going? Oh, let me get your update. <laughs> so I had the tea remember I was telling you about the tea the chamomile and then the other one I mixed them. it wasn't bad I mean it wasn't what I was going for but it wasn't like ugh, disgusting so I could do it again if need be you know so yeah that's just the update on that for y'all so it's not bad maybe I'll try it by itself I don't know. The lemon tea is lemon tea, so what could be bad about it is what it is. They telling you what you're getting. But the vanilla, I didn't really taste the vanilla, and it could have been because it was overpowered by the um by the lemon. Because if I put lemon in it and it was lemon tea, I'm about to have me a banana. I want a donut, but I'm gonna have a banana. Yeah, so I can't be on here too long. But this is my salad, y'all. You know the Asians ain't got the crispy wontons and then it got like some almonds in it listen the dressing the butter for something else do you hear that sizzling in the background that's me getting it all together let me show y'all y'all see it my peppers onions and mushrooms i put in there and then my sausages so yes I am not splitting them down the middle. I'm going to keep them whole because 
that's how we like them. So, pretty quick dinner. Fries is in the deep fryer. So, listen, it's during the week. It's Wednesday. We doing all things convenient here. You see? Like, listen, we ain't gotta be all extra. We eating and we good. We ain't got no time for no from scratch killing. Um, well, I don't even know. I don't know. I usually do chop my onions up on Sunday for the week because um, me and Ari love onions. So she want to make her something. Maybe I'm not going to cook. She want to, or she want to cook so she can have them already um, for her prep. I don't really get peppers that much because they usually go bad for me. So that's why I was like, this is a convenience. And I usually wouldn't buy them in that packaging if I wasn't cooking them within like two days. You know, sometimes they cut them. You don't know when they killed them. So, not why be saying pills. You don't know when they chop them up and put them in that packaging and stuff. You don't want to be having that old, but I don't know if y'all can really hear me over this vent. So, I'm going to go, but I was just showing y'all that real quick. Dinner almost done. Dinner almost. Oh, I feel the testing with Ari. Dinner almost done. Dinner almost done. Dinner is done. You feel me? Look at that. Ah, ah, ah. My salad. Told y'all my couple fries. Yes, I did still get them. But yes, look at that. All yummy goodness. All right, I'm about to eat. Hey y'all, good morning. Happy Friday. Happy is the Fridays. Only because it's Friday. Ain't much going on. It's a full moon. So be very intentional in your day. Mind your moods. Write down your intentions. And yeah, all that. I don't know if y'all remember. I'm going to wrap it right around real quick. But I first got my hair cut. I had showed y'all I wrapped my hair. And I was like, oh, when you wrap it, you could tell she put a lot of product on it. Because it was wrapping around too easy. And it was just staying up. You know? But now, I don't know if you can see the vibes a little different. Like, see how I got these cut pieces? You can see. You know, that was a cut. So, you know, if I shake it, it's coming down. Before that thing was stuck. But yeah, so I'm about to unwrap my hair, get my day started. Again, it's Friday. Nothing planned at all. So, this is what I'm going to do. Y'all, I've been looking at the long shunk bags. And I'm deciding if I like them or not. They've been around for so long. So, when you find something like that, you see it, and you don't have it in your collection, you like, well, for me, I'm like, why well, I don't have one? I think I had an opportunity before, and I kind of—I think I recently had the opportunity, and I went with the Mark Jacobs tote, and was like, "Yeah, no, I ain't gonna do it." And I didn't do it, but now I'm like, "Should I?" They've been on sale a lot at um, like Nordstrom's Rack. You've been able to find some for a decent price. So I'm like, "Should I just?" I mean, don't know what style if it's current or whatever, but. Do that really matter? All this stuff just recycling and coming back, you know? So, yeah, that's what your girl's gonna do. Have my mood rings on today. Well, I mostly have them on every day, but I'm showing them to y'all today. And let me tell y'all, Amazon is playing in my face. So, I ordered something, prime item, and I was supposed to have it by Tuesday. Now, I'm ordering it early because I'm like, oh, it's for a boogie because her birthday coming up. So, I'm like, let me make sure I got it on deck. I ain't, I ain't got it on deck because they're talking about, oh, um, you know how you do package arriving late. If it's not here by this day, get it so three extra days. If it's not here by this day, then you can get a refund. So, I still got a whole nother day. And then if it don't come, though, what am I going to do? It's crunch time now. I thought I ordered it early. Now, do I order it again and see? Like, does Prime catch it this time? So, I am highly annoyed about that because Amazon is playing in my face. And don't play with me. Do not play with me. Do not play with a mother when it comes to her cubs. You understand? I am a whole mommy. So, gotta figure that out. Um, Figure out what's gonna happen for a boogie birthday. She said what she wanna have a little party with a few friends. Nothing too serious, like one or two people but I'm like I don't know 
I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But I, again, got a little time. It's kind of last minute, but it's not last minute. Because again, it's not nothing too much. So, we're going to see about that too. The hair is giving whatever today. So, we're going to see about that too. But I'm just more so teed up about Amazon. Not even teed up. Annoyed with Amazon. Like, do what you say you want to do. Maybe I know you're trying to raise prices. Going into space and stuff. Please go into space and bring my stuff down. Get it delivered to my house. Because this ain't okay. That's when I did my part. You know? But nonetheless, I'm about to get to work. You know the quote. In order to get done, you got to start. So, in order to get closer to 430, I got to start. Because, yeah girl, ready to get off. I got a couple calls. Nothing too serious. Um, lots of emails. I think people just wait to the end of the day to send the emails. But then the next day, I'm like, bombarded with them. Nonetheless, hopefully it speeds my day up. Friday evening. Ain't nothing going on. About to eat my McDonald's. I got me a filet of fish with some fries and a vanilla milkshake. I've been craving a milkshake. I went to Wendy's maybe like two weeks ago when I had got lunch one day. And I'm like, oh yeah, I'll take vanilla milkshake. They was like uh, a frosty. <laughs> Oops, my bad. Oh, and I got some wine. I ain't gonna have it tonight, but I'm gonna tell y'all. So, you know, Stella hasn't been staring me wrong. I don't know if y'all can see it. So I got this Stella Rose. Rosa, Stella Rosa, green apple. So I might try that tomorrow. We gonna see. And then I got some Moscato one again. This is the one I had when I had Popeyes and wine. I know this one is good. But again, since they haven't steered me wrong, you know I like the Stella black. So now I'm gonna try this green apple and see if it's sweet. I like sweet. You know what? I didn't even think to look at the back. But it is vegan and gluten free. If you wanna know. Oh, it says a six. So semi-sweet. Yeah, I'm gonna try it tomorrow. Got too much going on tonight. You don't wanna have wine, milkshake. No, mm-mm. So yeah, that's it for me. I'm just my food, but I just wanted to show y'all my wine real quick before I get to it. Well, not get to it, but before I put it up. All right. Hey y'all, happy Saturday evening. It's been a day, it's been a day. Nah, not really. I just been lounging. Really didn't do too much today, but I'm about to get to it. But it's evening. Have me a little snack. White Castle got the shrimp nibbles back, and I like to put a little hot sauce on them. <laughs> Let's put it on the couch. But yeah, White Castle got the shrimp nibbles back, so I'm about to have some of these. I could have got me some tartar sauce. That's what I meant to get, but that's okay. I'm gonna just do the hot sauce. So I'm about to have these, and then I went to Papa John's. I was going to give me a papadilla because I kept seeing the commercial all day. But they ain't really had no deals. And when I get stuff, when I eat out, I try to get enough that's going to last for like two days so I can get my money's worth. So, since they didn't have that, I just got the two medium pizza deal. It's like a little mukbang around here because I got that. Um, Drew got Popeyes. A Boogie got KFC. And she got some shrimp nibblers too. So, yeah. Don't eat my shrimp nibblers. And then I gotta record some content for y'all. I got a spring, spring summer shoe haul. I got a what's in my Feather 21 bag because I need to go through that so I can put it up. So I'm gonna show y'all that. The spring, um, the spring sandal, spring summer sandal haul. That's gonna be, of course, a different video. Um, but I'm gonna record that today. And that's it, y'all. Y'all probably don't wanna hear me keep munching down on this, so. I'll be back. So I like the, are they peppercinis? The peppers, whatever. I like to bite it open and dab. Let me show you. Dab the juice on my pizza. So delicious. Hey y'all, so I think I showed y'all another video that I got this Dr. Brana's Tea Tree um, Pure Castile Soap. And I don't know how I feel about it. I haven't used it yet, but it, you can use it for multiple purposes. 
um, it says for hair, for shaving, um, what else does it say on here? Hair, shaving, clothes, <laughs> your body. So many things, like a plethora of things. So I, I'm not, I haven't ever been an all-in-one, and it stayed on the front, so I should have paid attention. I haven't been an all-in-one soap person ever. But um, anyway, I might still just give it a try just to give my like true real opinion, not just from <laughs> reading the directions, which make it seem very scary. But nonetheless, um, I'm gonna try it. But so I bought this, and it says that you gotta dilute it. So um, dilute it with water. I'm trying to find a part that told me to dilute it with water but oh here you go dilute enjoy one soap for 18 different uses shave shampoo shower bath detergent what type of skin you think i got <laughs> allegedly when people use it though they say oh it'll leave your skin feeling so good is that because it burnt it off like what what is it giving so anyway i'm gonna dilute it oh hold on my mom's calling me. my lovely mother hello I don't know. She probably hung up. But I was telling y'all. So I'm going to pour some in here because me and Juice said we want to share it. So I'm going to open it up, dilute it with water, and I'm going to give it a fighting chance. It smells like iodine. I am not going to surgery. I need to do this over the sink. But yeah, so I'm going to dilute it with water. And I think I'll come back and let y'all know what it's giving if I use it. Or maybe Jewel will come back and let you know if she used it. It's just, it's giving a whole lot for me right now. I'm about to get to the closing of this video. I think I'm about to close it out um, after this. I'm going to do a What's in My Favorite 21 bag. But if I don't close it out, just enjoy the extra content. But just in case, letting y'all know. I'm trying to think if I should get some wine. Because I already had my dinner. And I said I was going to try that wine. I'm going to get the wine. And I'm going to be right back. Okay, y'all. So, I'm back. I got my wine. So, this is the green um, apple Stella Rosa. So, some people say Stella Rosa. I say Stella Rosa. Stella. Let's call it by her first name. So, this is the green apple Stella Rosa. First taste. It's good. You know what it's giving? It's giving birdie. If you ever had Verdi before, V E R D I. If you ever had Verdi before, that's exactly what this tastes like. But it's good. Yeah, I could do this. All right, now let me try not to knock it over or try to get my stuff. Cause like I said, I'm gonna do the Fever Twenty One. What's in my bag? So here is the bag. And we going to go this however what's on top whatever so i believe two things out of here y'all already saw if you watched my um the philly vlog because you saw at the end we did like a family gift exchange so two of the items you probably already saw but if not sit down tune and get your one and let's enjoy so without further ado I got this purse. Straps look a little catty wonky, but I'll work on that. And then it has a crossbody strap as well, so you can make it a crossbody. I thought this was really cute. Um, who knows, summer coming. I'm going on vacation next month. Just a little quick something you can put on pair it with a cute little dress or like some denim shorts and like a bright top I thought that was cute I got this crop fleece all right with teddy bears on it I thought this was really cute I got me like this bralette type shirt. Put this on with like a jean jacket. It fits really well too. I tried it on. Put that one with like a jean jacket and some sweats or like some shorts. Even put it underneath like a button up. 
like a real loose fitting button up. So I have that. I got the white purse. I got it in black. But this was this and the teddy bear fleece was a part of the gift exchange. So I liked it that much. Well, not even that I liked it that much. I had this first and when I got to dinner, I found out I got this one. So it was a bonus for me. But I like them both. Again, both could be good vacation like purse pieces. I just got some sweat shorts. These are very comfy, cozy, spring, summer. I'm trying to fold it how I would, so I don't have to go back and do it again. So I got those. Those in the extra large. And that top was, um, the fleece was a 2X, and the bralette was a 2X as well. Got a Snoopy crop top. Get on it. You saw a poppy in a lip. Oh, I got a little bit. <sighs> but yeah, sorry, I'm folding as I go because I don't want to do more work. But yeah, I thought this would be cute. This could even be cute with, right? Pay it together real nice. Nice little comfy. I don't think you could put that on like some slides, some ones. I got some sweats, extra large. Oh, and that crop top is a 3X. This is an extra large sweat pant. And thinking about the um, brawler that I got, you could wear that with these sweats. A jean jack, they a little high. I like to pull my stuff up over the tummy a little bit, so. Look at that. Pair that with a jean jacket. It's a vibe. We out here and we chilling. What else? Oh, I got one of these. This wasn't from Forever 21, but it was in the Forever 21 bag. I don't know what to call them, but I know it's like the emotion. So, happy. Angry, upset. So I could have used this during the week because this was a rough week. It was busy at work. It was just crazy. For moon was approaching. So I probably would have had it on this side a couple times. But right now, I'm chilling. So I got this. Um, that was from a store in the mall. I got this t-shirt. Selena, Selena shirt on. What this Selena shirt? I thought this was cute. Remind me of like a cover of a magazine. It says the Queen of Cumbia. So yes, yeah. so I think I said that if you watch my and if you haven't go ahead and watch it in my about me video. I love Selena. And I like how it looks kind of distressed. This is cute with some jeans, quick little flip flop, some sneakers, rainy day. I thought that was cute. Then I just got a basic shirt. Throw it on for anything. Just going outside, whatever. Um, Selena is an extra large. This shirt is an extra large too. And then I got some accessories. So y'all know I'm the accessory queen. I sell accessories, a couple styles. Um, www.acouplestyles if you want to see what I got. But I also got some, um, cause again, for one of my trips, you get those miscellaneous pieces that, you know, something happens to you, you want to wear it in the water, it messes up, you're not worried about it. So, a little tangled, but I got these crosses. like a layered necklace if I could get it untangled 
Maybe not. Oh, there we go. So it's a layered look. One's a little smaller. So I got that. Some bracelets just to throw on. And I got some sunnies. So as you know, I love, love, love gold. But I got these just for a switch up. So they do have the silver like chain link handles on the side. Figured I'd throw on like some silver hoops with these. I thought these was like a good vacation vibe. What y'all think? Let me know. Comment down below. So yeah, that is what's in my Fabulous 21 bag. Fabulous 21, like, I feel like that's always been like a good go-to store, especially for like spring, summer. Um, then when they had a sale like the fleeces and stuff, sweatpants, in the winter time, I feel like it's a good vibe. They, with Shein, Fashion Nova, Pretty Little Thing. I feel like a lot of people go towards the online route. But you can still find some quality, quick, basic, you know, nice vacation, nice dresses, just for event type thing. And not that you gotta wear them one time. Um, you can find them there at 21. So, your girl ain't giving up on them because as much as I online shop, I like to go in and touch my stuff. And Pretty Little Thing, Fashion Nova, Shein, we know those ain't here where I'm at. So, next best bet. It's Forever 21 to go in there and see what they got going. So, if you made it this far, definitely make sure you hit that thumbs up button. It helps my channel. <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you want to see. Let me know that you're here, you watching, and you feeling it. You saw something today that you like. You saw something from the Forever 21 that you like. Girl, tell me how it wear. You know, how you felt when you wore it. How did you style it? Let me know. And I can come back and let y'all know. So, thank you guys again. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you soon, stylers. It's mine good. For real, for real.